Hey everyone, so today I got to do an amended review of the original Swordman review. Shortly after that first video came out, I had some big problems with the Swordman. First, the switch that turns the engine off, that malfunctioned. So the only way I could turn the engine off was to either cut the fuel or pull the spark plug. Then shortly after that, the gears inside the rear drum, they started grinding and the machine would not move forward. So, essentially, the machine was pretty much broken. So I had to go consult with the manual just to make sure that the machine is still under warranty. I believe, I remember when I bought it, it was like 24 months. Uh, so I, was, I had owned it for maybe like 19 months. So it should have been covered under warranty, but I had to go check the manual just to make sure. Fortunately, the warranty is 24 months, but, you know... Who knows, maybe uh, Swordman closed up shop and ran away. I have no idea, so I was about to find out. I emailed Real Rollers where I bought the Swordman from, and I explained to them what was going on, and they said, hey, we'll send you a link to the Swordman warranty page. So I went on and I filled that page out. I had to put my name in, I had to put my serial number in, date of purchase, and I uploaded a couple of photos and videos of the problem that I was having with the machine. A few days go by and I'm starting to wonder if they're going to ever respond to me. Um, so I sent them another email and I said, Hey, have you heard anything about the warranty claim that I filed? The next day they got back to me and they're like, Hey, sorry, um, you're going to hear from real rollers. Uh, so just pay attention to your email. So the next day I got an email from Eric Draper and he said, Hey, I put a drum in the mail. Uh, you should get it in a few days. While you're waiting, take your machine to a local repair shop and they will fix the switch for you and then have, and then send the bill to me and we'll pick that up. So I've been kind of busy and I wasn't able to get it over to a repair shop yet. However, I did get the drum a few days later and I was able to start replacing that. <laughs> However, I did have a problem getting one of the bearings off of the drum. So I sent another email to Eric and I said, hey, I just cannot get this bearing off. Is there any way I can order another bearing? And he was like, oh, no, no, don't worry about ordering a bearing. I'll send that right up to you. About a week later, I got my bearing and I was finally able to get the swarming back together. And today, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a test run just to make sure everything is working okay before I take it over and get that switch fixed. Plus, I just want to make sure that the machine still has a beautiful cut and that all of this is worth it. I do want to say that Real Rollers has been great through this process. Their customer service is top notch. I really do appreciate it. They have not let me down at all. So let's give it a shot and see how it does. Even though I fully expect more parts on it to break and it's a total pain in the ass to have them shipped to you 
It's still got a beautiful cut to it, and in the end, it's worth it. I feel like you can be confident in real rollers and that they're going to take care of you and they're going to stay true to that 24 month warranty. If you have any questions, you can let me know in the comments below. I appreciate you watching and we'll see you next time.